Welcome Guardians, on this video we'll discuss some of the information about Season 11, some of the Eververse changes, sandbox changes and raid and trial rewards. Welcome back. On June the 6th Rasputin was at its full power and we the guardians of destiny together with the Rasputin have demolished the almighty and with that it is time for the departure of the season of Wolfie and we await for the future of destiny 2 so on the June the 9th at 9 a.m. PDT time which is around 5 p.m. UK time the reveal of destiny's new season 11 starts Deej did mention that their channel will be on live and you can join in for chat. Now according to the game rant, um, there has been a leak of the name of the new season. This might not be true, but based on the language and the location, every name is slightly different from each other. In French, it's season of arrival. In Spanish, it's season of visitors. However, it does seem there is a arrival of some kind of darkness, maybe in the triangle ships, and we as a guardian have to go up to defeat the darkness. Now let's quickly have a look at the two reveals um, that Bungie has revealed in the uh, past few days. Um, this never has happened that Bungie never gave us any clue before a new season launch. So let's have a look. I will very quickly go over Destiny's um, 2.9.0 patch notes reviews really quickly and some of the changes that you will see during your gameplay. Now the first one is that if I was um, changes uh, states we have shifted the season 11 armor offering to be a gameplay reward for aspirational content. The season of offerings on ornament sets are returning to the storefront, added an additional 2300 bright dust to the season pass and highly requested items from the previous season will once again be available in this season. Next up the sandbox changes. The powerful friend armor mod will no longer stack. If multiple copies of this mod are equipped, the mods will provide no bonus stats. Only solo seasonal mods are intended to stack no part of arc mods are intended to have stacking functionality. Powerful friend granted plus 20 to mobility which players could leverage to get free stack column to max of 100 points. Season 11 introduces a new arc mod, an enhanced auto rifle, uh, fusion rifle and bow loader armor mods now have a chance to drop from the pinnacle mod sources. As for the raid rewards, um, the weapon 1000 voices, anarchy, always on time, have um, increased drop chances. The drop chances begin at 10% and increases to a maximum of 50% over 20 clearance of the raid. As of trial rewards, you have additional masterwork material rewards will be dropping at 3, 5 and 7 wins. The bounty reward will now match the milestone reward of the week. Trials token distribution has rebalanced. Trial tokens are no longer rewarded after the match completion. And the passage of wealth now doubles the bonus trial token earned in 3, 5 and 7 wins. And now there is an overview of controller remapping feature that the team has been working on and are hoping to see it in action at the beginning of the season 11. You'll be able to go um, setting screen and from there a custom option is available under the buttons layout. 
you should be able to customize mapping for your gameplay character and vehicle etc. With all this information aside, Bungie has been really mysterious about the reveal of this season. So Guardians, not long now, gear up and get ready to fight the darkness. As always, thank you for watching. If you like to see more Destiny videos, please subscribe and thank you for watching.